Welcome back, everybody. We are playing more Kingdom Hearts. Yay, Kingdom Hearts. Uh, in the last episode... Do you remember what happened in the last episode? Yeah, we're trying to we're trying to save Alice. Yeah, but like we found like the smell, the stench, right. the stuff, and then all of a sudden like we opened up a box and there was a Heartless and the Queen was all like, Nope, she's still guilty, or something like that. Right. She's like, oh, evidence means nothing. I rule. Yeah. Oh. Oh, these fat. Oh, these guys. Look at that. He's so big. Oh, what's going on? And then the like the little like like the tum tum drum that they yeah. they make when you whack them. Oh. So Donald. how have you been, everybody? Been good lately. I hope you've been good. I hope you're enjoying this because uh, there's a lot to go left oh, in this yeah. game. So much. So much to go. And we're not even thinking of like doing like, full playthrough. Oh man, so many things. So much the muns. Get the fat muns. Get the fat muns. Like, see, look at the big one. It's just right there. Yeah. All 25 of that muns. Muns for days. Mm. What do we even use money for again? Uh, buying items. Oh, that's item right. Oh, I forgot. Was there money? Was there item buying in the second one? Uh, probably. I don't remember. Deep freeze. See ya. Deep freeze. Techie XP. What does Techie XP do? I think it's just bonus EXP for doing smart things. Oh, uh, yeah, like, like uh, oh, you killed the fire guy with ice? There's you an extra being thing. Oh. Ah. What the heck? Why is there all that like weird flashing going on? Uh, it's because we're he and I are clashing. So like when he does his little kick flip, mm -hmm. kick flip, oh, nice. Um, it's blocking my sword attack, so neither of us hurt uh, each other. But uh, conversely, it's also to give me the ability to not get hurt when he does his kick flip. Oh, uh, it's like parrying an attack. Yeah, it's parrying. Oh, got it, got it. That's always good. I like that. It's a, it's a nice little thing to put in. Because, um, what is it, like, Street Fighter that does, like, the priority system? Yeah. Where, like, certain abilities have different levels of priority, mm -hmm. and so, like, a kick will override a punch, but a punch can... Or a punch overrides a kick because the punches are faster. Right, yeah. There's, there's like, speeds to some of them. Yeah. A very merry unbirthday. No. Wouldn't right. an unbirthday mean that you're being killed? No. I mean... It is the unbirthing... It is your day of being unbirthed. Right, yeah. No, I, I see what you're saying. I see what you're saying. Mm -hmm, I mm -hmm. know in the context of the movie... And then birthday is every day that is not your birthday. Yes. But well, that makes that still makes sense. I get that. Like, but I, I think what you're getting at to... is that the better phrasing that might be your non-birthday. Yeah. But that's not as hard to say. No, it's not. Uh, what are we supposed to be doing here? Are we no. supposed to like examine that that picture or? No. I'm trying to remember what it is we're doing. Uh, we have to like. I remember we had to come here. You know what? I wonder if there's a journal in this, like, game where it's like, here's the last thing that happened. Last time on Kingdom Hearts. Yeah. Goku battled the Heartless. Goku's not in oh my god. Could you imagine if Goku was in this game? If they actually got licensing to add all the DBZ characters. Oh my god, that would be nonsense. Which also begs the question, like, um, since... Disney technically owns the licensing for uh, all of Miyazaki films. Does that mean that we can go to, like, Ponyo's World? Maybe. I mean, it did have, um, what's it called in it? Hmm. Little Mermaid? Uh, no. Little Mermaid. But, like, a, uh, what's it called? A Nightmare Before Christmas. Ah, but it, wasn't that also Disney, though? Right, but it's, uh, Tim Burton. Uh, so basically, what I'm getting at is that we, we have precedents for non-direct, like, Disney movies being uh -huh. options. Uh, that makes sense. That would be kind of cool. I would totally be down for Ponyo World. Or, like, Howl's Moving Castle. 
Even though isn't House Moving Castle like a book that then got uh... opened up again? No, I thought that was I thought the first one was Goofy got defense. Oh, up. you're right. I missed that. And then now you just unlock tech boost or something like that, yeah. which I have no clue what that'll do. Does that mean that you get like more tech points now, oh. or? Oh. Nope. Nope. Donald's still all jacked up. What? What? Oh, he's dead. He is flat up and down, just not in the fight. Yep. Oh, the, the AI in this game. No, building smart AI is hard. It is very hard. That's why I'm both excited and terrified for, uh, what is it, DeepMind is doing with uh, StarCraft 2. Oh, yeah? They talked about it um, at BlizzCon. Uh -huh. and they've been teaching DeepMind to play StarCraft, mm -hmm. <coughs> which is a very interesting and exciting prospect. So... I am convinced this is how the robot apocalypse happens. I mean, you're not wrong, but also we gotta we gotta take into account that like one of the things, or at least in my opinion, one of the things that uh, a lot of people say when they're like, "I want smarter AI in the game," mm -hmm. they don't necessarily like. At least for me, I don't necessarily want like a smarter, smarter AI because. For the most part, the way to make a smarter AI is to give it an advantage over the player to, like, predict certain things. Possibly. Well, I think but. that... I don't think that's smarter AI. I think that's a stopgap that we currently use because AI is smart. You have to put out those candles inside of the thing, I think. No, we lit those. Did we? Oh, like, yeah. try putting them out, though, and see what happens. But, like, I think the thing that we, like, at least I want is more challenging AI, like... An AI that makes me feel like I accomplished something for beating it. Right. Like, and making a smarter AI, like, already lit. So, I think we put it out with Liz. No. Or not. Yeah, because okay. we came in here and lit these. I forget what that did. It did something. Right, let's, I got an idea. Let's go back to the first room. This is like the upside down room. Yeah. <clears throat> but like, uh, like, in my opinion, I want something that's more challenging. Like, something that, like... Not necessarily is like smart enough to learn from my mistakes and learn my tactics and do all kinds of crazy stuff, but like something that isn't necessarily like like uh, necessarily like playing against another human being, but like I don't know, just, just like it, it it pushes you like maybe to a small degrees in degrees in degrees in maybe to a smaller degree. no degrees in. <laughs> Maybe to a smaller degree, like DeepMind will help with this because it'll be able to create a reactive and semi-intelligent uh, AI system that can predict and, to a degree, learn your tactics, but not so much that it can know or think what you're going to do. Ah, you'll, have, you'll, you'll be better? Have a higher. better view from higher up. So does that mean to climb or yeah, to, I to, I to get to big? I have to get big, I think. Because uh, he was up here. Oh, oh, oh. Clever. The shadows should, should be here soon. Are you prepared for the worst? Oh. So what is up with this guy? I actually vaguely remember him. What is he? Like, he's just some sort of... Like, obviously he's a oh. heartless. Oh, oh, what happened? He's, just, he's weird. He is. Like, you know what he reminds me of? <clears throat> like, he uh, is wrecking Donald. Well, Donald's... Maybe, maybe Donald, you know, as the caster, who don't get into melee. Yeah, like, is there a way for us to, like, alter their AI? I don't think so. I thought there was. Maybe. So, like, what are we supposed to do? Like, jump up and... Yep. Oh, yep. Okay. Also, it would help if I had some magic. You have enough for one spell. Well, that, that did not. Oh, his thing's on fire now. Oh, look at that. 
But then again, isn't he like a fire twirler or yeah, something like that? Oh. Oh, knock him down. And he's all like, oh, I love like the, the twirling of the flames and whatnot. Oh, that's why the Cheshire Cat was like, you should you should get higher up. It'd be easier. He was giving me a hint for the boss. Uh, okay, so your job is to get back up there and then. That's like, actually pretty clever. And like hit him with a, with a spell or something. That's a clever way for the game to kind of teach me that, hey, <clears throat> unlike the first boss, you can only hit this guy in his like midsection here. Mm hmm. Yeah, it's, um. It's. Oh. It's very interesting that uh, they did that. Oh, he's on the ground. Oh, oh and then it's like, but his lip batons still do damage. To him. Yeah, so it's like you want to like hit them to put them out. Oh, and he broke the chair. He broke the chair, so you have to move him towards that other section over there. Oh, or do that. And it's twirling now. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah. Oh. Ah. Okay. Oh, you're down again? He's been down this whole no, fight. No, he got back up at one point, and then immediately ran into melee. Yeah. He's, oh my god. He's a rage mage. Oh. Oh. There's the chair. What the heck, chair? It's Wonderland. Yeah, that's true. Oh, and the thing stopped twirling. Yeah. Oh, oh. You may want to... Yep. Ooh, that's a high potion too. Uh, that's all right. Next time we have an opportunity, we'll go, we'll go shopping. I don't know about you, but like I'm very much a big proponent of like using all of my like low grade items as much as I can. Oh yeah, for sure. Like I very much always try to like stock up on like super low grade items constantly, so that way I can just spam the heck out of them. Correct. And what happens if you light both of his things on fire? Does it change his, like, attack pattern or something? I don't, I don't actually even know if I lit it on fire. Huh. What's that? Interesting. Part of me that's much wonders if it didn't happen. Like you, see, look, you, see Donald's back up again. Oh, okay, there he is. And he's I mean, right the, in the thick of it. Yeah, I told you, he's a rage man. He is. He has an entire spell that he can cast. Uh-huh. Donald, why? Oh. You, oh, oh, he's lighting, lighting it on the fireplace. Them. So maybe you have to like put them out and it like maybe. does something to him. Oh, oh he, he destroyed, destroyed the, the table. table. Huh. Oh. oh. That was not it's fun. It's getting real now. Yeah. All right, all right. Oh, the table's back. Uh, nope, just the chair. Never mind. Donald down oh. again. I swear, there has to be something to do. Like... Like, there has to be a way that we can go in and like modify the AI to be like, no, you need to stay the f away. Maybe. And only. Oh, the movie's down too. Yep. It's all right. It's all right. We're fine. It means it's time to keep the distance. Oh. Cheating oh, fire this? Ooh, he's cheating! Fire. I don't know if that actually does any damage. Yeah. I mean, it makes it sound like it, it deals damage. Ooh. Ow! Yep. Oh, oh. no! Alright. <clears throat> that didn't go well. No. Welcome back, everybody. Uh, Steve realized, and uh, we realized, oh. I should say, that uh, there were some small things that we yeah. needed to change. Like, we had a bunch of AP abilities that we hadn't been using. Yeah. Uh, Didn't realize we gained as much AP as we had. Oh, he's dead. Oh, yeah, dead. <laughs> <laughs> and, that was uh, slightly easier this time around. Yeah, and I believe I just saw that Donald just got some AP as well. Nice. Oh, no. My head is a bunch of cat food cans. Oh, he's at it. He has like cat food hand, 
cans for heads and arms that are made out of like those like when you take like a piece of paper and you like cut it like that yeah like, like make it as long as possible scrunchy paper yeah Ooh, ifrit's, ifrit's horn. horn ifrit or ifrit mm. i've always what called it ifrit racket. i've always called it ifrit How um, the door to get any sleep i think <laughs> ifrit is the stick it in his mouth Stick it in his mouth. Oh, yeah. You know you want to. Oh, oh I couldn't yeah. hold oh. it Oh. It sounded like something closed. That's right. We sealed the world. Oh, and we get gummy pieces for it. Oh. Nav-G gummy. I believe the Navi-G is the one that allows you to warp. Oh, no. It allows you to go to other locations. Yes. Yeah. She's gone off with the shadows in the darkness. No. Just like me. It's like, come on, cat. You could have helped her out at least no. a little bit. Have you met the Cheshire cat? Oh, he's a total douche. He's a total guy la douche. Yeah, total d bag. Um. Um. What were we saying? We're talking about something before all that went down. Uh, you were at the beginning where you go to the gummy ship. I don't, really I, I don't remember if you get anything there. There's... Ooh, that's oh. so big. Yeah, you gotta get small. So big. Gotta get small. So no, I don't wanna. Or you go there. I don't wanna. But you're gonna have to. No, drink it. Drink it. Drink it down. So what were you gonna say now? Um... I don't remember now. Oh, okay. Well... Uh... I don't remember if anything happens because of this. No, I don't think so. Like, I don't but think. I mean, I, I do know there's 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 stuff. Uh -huh. and I, I don't know how much like because there's treasure chests up here. See yeah, them? but I thought you had to get like your other blades and then you come back to these locations. No, I don't think so. I think I I think I kind of remember how to get up there. Uh huh. But it's one of those like I don't fully remember how to do it. Like, like I think it has to do with leaping like into that crevice. Uh huh. Into the, the into the top part or to the one off to the far in right? The, in the, the little hole in the tree. Yeah, so then you need to go to the other side. You need yeah. to, not, not there, but I gotta go this way. No! Oh, Ooh, yay! Save! Thanks, game! Burr, 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 burr. Well, no, you gotta go to the other way. So, like, over to the right? This way? No, no, no. Like, down to the right over there where the red flower is. Oh, I see what you're saying. Yeah, you go into that little area, and there's some mushrooms in there that allows you to jump up to there. Yeah, right here. Yeah, see? I love the music in this game. Yeah. It is It is strangely, like... Just jump. Uh, I think no. there is something you have to do. So, here. talk to the yellow flower, I think? I think the yellow flower sprays you with stuff What's that allows you to... Yeah, give it a potion, then. I don't want to give it a potion. Well, you got to give it a potion if you want to get big. This should help. But I don't know if getting big is the right choice. No, because what? You get big, and then you go over to the tree, and you slap it. Slap you. And then you knock up that, like, uh, acorn over there. Well, the acorn just makes me small. Yeah, but you need to slap it, and then you need to grab the acorn to get small. Uh -huh. To then go over there and jump on that and get into that little corner over there, which then you'll have a platform that you can stand on to get inside the tree. Okay. I, if I remember correctly. Let's see. Let's find out. I'm not using my memory here. I'm using my... Your brain? Brain? I remember all. No, that only tells you if you've forgotten something. Man, you know that would be going off. All the time. All the time in the world. Which is, which is, uh, hey, you know what? I'm not gonna say it. What? No, I'm not gonna say it. No, what? No, Tom? no what? nothing. Nothing. What? You gonna talk some shit? No, I wasn't gonna talk some shit. I was gonna talk some, uh, you took some, some nerd shit. You took some shit? I go over there, and then I think you have to get over to that like little corner right there where you see like there's a, a flower right there. 
Yeah. So you got to get to that corner somehow. Which I remember you doing it before. But the, you can't see the tree from over here, see? There's no entrance over this side. Then you need to make a... Oh, you need to make something grow. Which I believe that yellow one over there does. So, like, if you go over there... Yeah, like, so you're gone. One? What's this one? I don't know. Give me the ether. No, ethers are hard to find, lady. Or, uh, Haiti? flower. Ethers are hard to find. I don't know. Thanks. Thanks. You're welcome? Okay. You're welcome. You are welcome. Oh, oh, there we go. Yay. Yay! We did it. We just went the wrong way. Yeah, to the bizarre room. Like oh. normal. Oh. Oh, oh, ho, ho, ho. Well. We are on the side of the wall. Weird. So that's where uh, the fire happened. Yeah. Oh, this is trippy. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Oh, I am weirded out right now. Uh... I'm not even sure where I can go. Oh. oh. Hello. Hello, pot. I like pot. Pot is good. Oh, then you jump into that. You go over there to the, the other... God, I keep, think, I keep feeling like I'm going to fall. Either you need to go in there or you need to slap the thing above it, which is the little spigot. Yeah. Like, hit that. Boom. Oh, wait. Turn. Boom. And then we made it grow. All right. And then uh, either we have to jump now inside of it from here or we have to go all... Yeah. Yeah. We yeah, we did it. Or at least we got this one. Meteor, meteor G. Meteor G. This G is so meteor. Mm, it's the meatiest oh. of Gs. No. Has something to do with that entrance. That one? Yeah. We need to get up here. I mean, there's already a thingy up there. And there's also that um, boulder right there, which I think you have to, like, knock that into something. I think we did that already. No, because I think you already like, kicked it out of the way, and then you need to, like, throw it somewhere else. Like, you need to, like, push it into the water or something. Maybe. We try that. Oh, maybe I'm wrong. Probably wrong. We're not? Let's try it. Well, no, like, I, I, do you have to get bigger for that? I'm pretty sure I, I'm pretty sure I can't do it. Mm. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I thought we moved the boulder already. Yeah, we did, because that moving the boulder made that grow. Oh, okay. At least I think so. Uh huh. So on the um, Yeah. So, I like how the water is actually just like a flat plane. Yeah, it, oh, look, there's a mushroom there you can jump up to. Is it? Is it that you can jump oh. to it? I'm get to it. Hmm. Invisible walls. For invisible. <laughs> malls. Paris. Don't know. Yeah, there's definitely a mushroom there. Yeah. Which means that you should be able to jump there somehow. Yeah. Alright. How? Like, maybe you jump on the, the rock and then, like. No. No. There's a way, like, part of me thinks that there's, like, a, I wonder if there's a spot you can jump down over there. Uh-huh. Maybe if you give that, that red flower an ether, something will happen. No. Red flower don't get good stuff. Oh. That poor red flower. Yeah, that's right. That poor red flower. Why are you so mean to the red flower? Oh, well, there's an entrance over there. See it? Yeah, or it's a... Oh! And there's a pink thingy in there, too. I have no clue what that is. Either way, we should probably move on to the next That's what I'm thinking. All right. Yeah, I don't think these are super important. Let's, yeah. Let's move we, on. We can always come back here later during, yeah. an, uh, during the I downtime. I don't know if we're going to do a, a completionist run-through. No, definitely not a completionist run-through. But off to the gummy ship. Yeah, and, uh, my... Where the, why is there just that one green book in there? So strange. Because it loves you? I, uh, I don't love it. That's when I accidentally drink the wrong potion and just get even smaller. I'm just like, um. I can't drink the other one because the particles inside of it are too big and they'll kill me if I eat them. I forget how to actually get out of here. Uh, safe? Oh, yeah, gummy ship. Really? More for the gummy ship? Or the gummy ship. Sweet. Right. So now uh, we can go to here. Yeah, or we can go to the gummy garage and install the Navi G. 
or we can go back to Traverse Town and open up that freaking candle chest. Oh yeah, candle chest. Yeah. Oh, and of course, we get to do this. I'm trying to shoot. Uh, I don't know, but you know what? We'll be back to Traverse Town in just a second. Welcome back, everybody. Wow, we wow. made it back to Traverse Town, and dun, dun, oh, dun, dun, dun. we had to build a new gummy ship, and we had to get everything set, and then we had to go and actually do the whole like, oh, go run around and shoot the stuff and the things and the gummy. Target the candle. Deep freeze. And it's out for good. Now, now you're mine. <laughs> it feels so no! <laughs> it feels so good to be a gangster. gangster. Defense up! So isn't defense up an item that we like? We, we have somebody eat. No, oh, go get an iron. Atoms. Eat thumbs. Defense all. Raise defense by one. Sweet. Permanent defense up. And now all we oh. gotta do is we can go online and we look for an item duplication hack and then we just duplicate that 999 uh. times times three. Pew, 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 pew. And then nobody can ever die. Real G Gangster! Because Real G Gangster is always cheap. Real G Gangster! We're going oh, here. Oh, and we get to go and do this one. Hey, you know what? Now that I got like a super laser pew. beam, it's kind of fun. It's so long as you have power. Because that's the fun thing. But it's so destructive, you're just like, mass destruction. Don't, don't forget to collect art. I'm trying. Get those Aereo Gs, they give you better, like, nukeability. Aereo Gs. Aereo G. Fox, do a barrel roll. I, I can't, Skippy. Or, Fox! Is, is it Skippy? No, it's is Peppy. It Pepper? Peppy? Oh, General Pepper. Daryl Pepper. Have you, you ever played the later ones where that game got like super dark? Are you talking about like Star Fox 64 dark? No. Darker. Are we talking the, about like, I think it was, was GameCube? Are we talking about the one where it was like you're on a planet and it was supposed to be Crystal's Adventures and then there's this no. like. No, women can't be the stars of a video game. What's wrong with you? No, way darker than that. Oh, I don't really like Get those stars! Special! Special! You are I'm special. special! Hey, we got another Dispel G. Dispel G! Uh, no. I don't remember them then. So, like... Uh... I remember there was the one in Star Fox 64 where you're fighting against Star Wolf. And uh, Piggy was all like, just like how I betrayed your father, Fox. And you're like, the fuck, dude? That one was jacked up. It's and like, it was even worse than that. Because he said, uh, the, literally the line was, I'm going to make you squeal just like I made your daddy squeal or something like get that. Get that orb over there. Get it, get it, get it, get it. Shiva. Make a Shiva. Ow. Make a Shiva. Oh, we got Arioga. Ariora. I didn't know Hercules was already. Hey, we get to do Hercules. This in Bork. This is always the fun one. So it was like the, I want to say it was the uh, GameCube one. Huh. You, but it basically ends with you having to crash with Peppy crashing the Great Wolf into like a hive ship because you're basically fighting like the Tyranids. And he dies. Like, he and Rob die. And you're like, oh, oh my. And then they came out with a DS one later on that was, like, after this. And it's just, like, super dark because, like, the whole Space Wolf team is disbanded. What? And, like, Slippy has gone back to his home planet. He gets married and he's just a tech specialist now. Like, he's building weapons. Uh-huh. Crystal leaves you. What? And goes and dates, like, Leon from Space Wolf. What? It's jacked. Okay, after this, when we take a break, I will show you. Well, it is. This jacked. is the perfect opportunity for that break. All right. All right, everybody. We will be back with more of this. Bye, everyone. Uh.